everybody hope you guys are doing good today we i'm so excited to bring you guys a highly highly demanded uh thing that you guys uh already wanted like this is this was a super super demanded clone that you guys actually requested a lot of times today we are going to be building the twitch clone guys let me know as you guys are coming in who is super excited about that and yeah i already see a couple of comments coming in and and, uh, and on so guys let me know who is excited for building the twitch clone using react js we're not gonna be building anything on the back end today and this thing actually is going to be receiving today's stream uh i can show you that in just a second so guys let me know who is excited to build the twitch clone and in and I've been preparing with this a lot. This is going to be some epic build. Yes, we see Nikhil. Uh, it says, let's go. <clears throat> Hi, Rishi. What up? Uh, Kenya represented. Awesome. Nice. Awesome. Awesome. So, guys, let me know who's excited, who is ready to build this Twitch clone. And we are... 205 people live right now that is awesome if you're excited about the twitch clone smash that like button so we can get this video out there to all uh, all the people all over on youtube so yes i am starting now <clears throat> hi everybody what is up so yeah today we are gonna be building the twitch clone which is a super super in demand build so let's actually get started by just showing around what we are gonna be doing inside of the app okay uh yeah so let's let's actually add some nice little background vibes and with that done i will go ahead and show my screen sub for Ox. <clears throat> how's it going uh we got bangladesh in the house hey how's it going man um yeah so let's actually get get going ahead and today we are gonna be building that thing over yeah this thing so as you can see this actually is able to receive the stream so this is something super cool and on the left hand like it's it's literally how uh clever programmers slack looks like so yeah uh we got a couple of super pumped people in a house that is awesome <coughs> hey what is up how's it going guys hey and let me actually scroll through the comments and i think we are good to start nice so guys let me know who's excited to build this uh i've prepared with a lot of love today for today's session we are almost at 300 people guys that is awesome let me know who's excited and who's ready to build the twitch clone with me today hey what is up what is up uh yeah so with that said I'm gonna go ahead and get started and this is actually not a Mern, Mern build today we are only focusing on the front end and to make the thing look like how you guys could see I'm gonna present that again so it's literally the clever programmer um, twitch page with a couple of nice little stuff we got all this embedding and all that stuff so yeah uh, let's get started with that said, I'm just going to go ahead and scroll back to this screen and I already have this uh, already have this terminal open. So guys, smash the like button if you are ready and if you're excited to build this and let me know who's ready, who is pumped to build the Twitch clone and yeah hey and we just got our first lovely donation from james thank you so much brother we really appreciate you and it's for cloud provider aws azure, uh, azure or google actually we always say uh firebase 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 like that is the number one 
Why we say it? It's super simple to use, very beginner friendly and super powerful. So it, it actually, uh, it is Google. So it's Google and we always, yeah. So, so pretty much Google and Firebase uh, inside of there. And yeah, that, that can pretty much handle all the backend stuff, all the database stuff with the real time database, authentication and all that. So we always say go with Firebase. Firebase is the best. I'm not sure I understand. Oh, <laughs> at the same time, Siri with oh, I was speaking to her. Okay, uh, welcome South Africa in the house. What is up, everybody? And let's actually get it going. Who's pumped? We are 304 people at the moment. Let me know, guys, if you're ready. And if you are, uh, <coughs> if you're ready to build this with me today, let's get it started. All right. So with that, uh, I'm going to switch back to screen share mode and let's actually get it going. So what we will do is the usual zooming in, uh, rich. And what we will say is pretty much npx create react app and we will say twitch clone and that will pretty much go ahead grab all the stuff that we might ever need uh, throughout this build this will pretty much just uh, set up a react app for us so that we don't have to worry about any of the headache that it actually uh, has uh, so yeah that's pretty much uh, what I am just running and in the meantime uh, let let me actually show ahead again on the application so we are gonna be building this nice little uh, header with all the uh, exact same twitch stuff I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and open up the real twitch and just to show you guys how it actually looks like and oops Okay, so because uh, because That's pretty <laughs> because I'm streaming at the moment, it looks a bit different. Uh, so yeah, and then we will have this nice little center part. Uh, we have this awesome background, which actually stays there as I scroll past. We also have the uh, nice left sidebar, and this is actually the exact stream, guys, that you are actually watching at the moment. So that's super awesome. You can literally go ahead and uh, do the same thing on your portfolio. So you can have like uh, an actual streaming part in your portfolio. So let me know if you're excited about that and smash the like button if you think this is gonna be an awesome build and if you're ready to put this on your portfolio and land a job as a developer in 2020 because our mission is to help 5,000 people get jobs as developers in 2020. So let me know who's excited about that and who's ready to put in the work and get it going. Let me know how's it go uh, who's ready about for that. So, <coughs> uh, yeah. <clears throat> okay. Uh, let's actually yeah so at the moment i have my create react app thing running it's done and you can you know that when it says happy hacking that means we are ready and uh, we are we can start going and hey what is up francisco everybody let, says let's go and mahi asks uh if i'm gonna be using webrtc on this build no, I'm not going to be using that. Um, we might as well have some kind of builds that will actually use it in the in the soon future. So stay tuned for that. Hey, what is up? <coughs> All right. So with that done, I'm going to pretty, pretty much go ahead and open up my VS code with say uh, code space dot and that will go ahead and open up my VS code and inside of here uh, first thing first let's zoom in just a bit and I'm gonna move the comments all over the place here and guys we are 294 people live at the moment 
I'm super excited to have you guys on this stream and yeah, let's get it started. So first thing first, what I will do is open up a new terminal and that is what we'll run. Um, oh, hey. <laughs> oh, I know what's happening. So inside of here, I need to see the into that folder and then I can run npm start. I was in the wrong folder. So this actually this terminal is going to be uh, running my <clears throat> this one is going to run my full uh, app react application. So yeah, that is awesome. And my application is up and running. So with that, we should be good to get started now um let's actually go ahead and start with our uh uh last stream hey, hey. <laughs> all right okay so what we're gonna be doing is first thing first we will go ahead and we will do the cleanup process as we always so let's actually delete logo.svg we will not do uh, testing today so both of the testing files can be deleted and yeah that's pretty much the start okay and also because react 17 is out in app.js you will not find an, an import react from react there is not not a case anymore so we will just uh, delete the logo svg import we will also go ahead delete everything from app.js and what else we will do is remove everything inside of the header and because we are going to be using the bem naming convention we will change the app to a lowercase in the uh, class name so next up what we will quickly do <clears throat> uh, what we will quickly do is let me quickly run through the comments okay awesome um and i think we sh we are good so with that uh let's actually go ahead and start uh mocking up how our application is going to look like and there is still some kind of error going on uh let me quickly refresh okay here we go we are we're good we're good so first thing first what we will do is we will create this part of the application the top bar this actually consists of three parts the, the top bar left the middle and the right hand side so those are the parts that we will actually add into today's build and next up is going to be this sidebar over here but that's for that's just uh, later on and we will also have this part which actually consists of two parts as well so with that let's actually uh, jump into it and what we will quickly do is we will say uh let's actually add the header first 